What's up guys, we're back with another epic mail video from mostly you guys and I bought more stuff off TCG Player, so we're gonna see how well we did there. But before that, the giveaway. I'll be giving away these three cards. We got a blue eyes shining dragon. And all you gotta do is like this video. Be subscribed and let me know what your favorite piece of mail is. And if you guys wanna send me mail, check out my PO box down below. Let's get into this. There's only three pieces of mail here, but there's some pretty epic stuff. So this is the TCG Player purchase. Let's see. I'm guessing that it's not going to be as good <laughs> in good a shape as last time because we took a risk on that red gecky and the condition was actually pretty decent. But here we have Oh, this is uh this is not what I thought it was. But yes, this is from TCG player as well. We have a blue eyes from Dark Legends, a super rare blue eyes. Have you Oh, whoops. As you guys can see, we got a few more cards in here. Let's see if we can cut this open. Let's get these cards out of here. All in one big top loader, which is a little scary, but it is one of those thick ones, so I think they should be okay. Let's see how this TCG player order went. We have not one, but seven Dark Legends Super Rare Blue Eyes. Let's see what condition they're in. They're supposed to be near mint. Supposedly, all seven were near mint. Let's see if they are. Here we go. Okay, the front of that one looks amazing. Okay, we're going to have some decent candidates here. This is like minty almost. That centering is really good. I'm going to be grading anything that's gradable because there are only two of these right now on the on the uh, PSA 10 pop report. And we were doing that Dark Legends opening the other day and I was like, wait a second. There's a, oh, there's a big print line back there. Or is that a scratch? Big scratch. Still near mint though, so not not upset about that. But I was like, I uh, I didn't know there was a blue eyes in this set, so I looked him up, and this guy had oh, there's a ding on this one. That's unfortunate. That one, oh man, other than that ding, it's pretty good. This guy had ten of these listed, and that was the only near mint listing on TCG Player. So I bought all of them. I bought all ten, and he said. Sorry, I accidentally, or I already sold three of them, and I had it was on eBay. I hadn't taken them off, so like, okay, I'll just get the seven. That's fine. That one looks pretty good. So I went ahead and bought ten Dark Legend Super Rare Blue Eyes. Hopefully, hoping for a couple of minty ones. So far, we have, I think, two that look pretty good. Out of the seven, a pretty nice one there. So it looks like these are. I mean, these are going to be have a decent chance to get a 10. I'm pretty excited about this. Dark Legends. It has the LOB, the LOB artwork, but it is a super rare from a 2008 release set, I think. Basically, the retro pack of the United States. So I'm pretty glad I bought these now with three of them already looking pretty good. Two, one had a scratch and one had a ding, but overall not bad. For seven, wow, that's five out of seven are really nice. I'm pretty happy with that. TCG player has come through for me recently. So you guys can, uh, the thing about TCG player, it's, it's individual sellers. So you either get a good seller or you get a bad seller. That's just how it works. So it's just kind of random. So you can't always fault TCG player for being bad because sometimes it's, you know, just a bad seller, but five were minty out of seven or at least near mint. So we're taking that. That's a pretty good purchase. I'm really happy with that. You guys will see these come back graded in about uh, two years. <laughs> Whenever we send them out and they get graded for two years. But I'm pretty happy about that. That went well. Let's move on to something even more epic. This is, looks like this got like almost opened by the post office. So hopefully nothing's too messed up. This is a purchase I made from one of you guys. You guys emailed me and asked if I wanted to buy some stuff. And I was like, yes, I do want to buy some stuff. Let's see what it is. Oh, here we go. Read me. Let's go ahead and read. It's a good thing I opened this on mail. I didn't realize this. Yo, Ruxin, thank you're always creating chill, funny, and amazing videos. For sure, you're my favorite Yu-Gi-Oh! Tuber. Yu-Gi-Oh! YouTuber. <laughs> Yu-Gi-Oh! Yu-Gi-Oh! Tuber. It's not Yu-Gi-Oh! Tuber. Yu -Tuber. For sure, you are my favorite Yu-Gi-Oh! YouTuber. Thank you. I hope you enjoy opening these packs. Oh, spoilers. <laughs> okay, and great luck. Besides the 12 packs that you bought, I threw in a few more packs and cards for you or the viewers. Once again, take care. Thank you and take care. CVL. So he threw in some cards for me or the viewers. So we're just going to go ahead and say that these are for you guys. Prohibition. That's actually a good one. And Upstart. These are all worth money. Those three. Cla Class Clown I did not think is, but it is a cool card. From European Metal Raiders. Also threw in this Pendulum Evolution pack. So this will be thrown in with the giveaway, guys. So remember to like and subscribe. So thank you for sending us those for all the, all the viewers. All right. So let's see what packs did I buy 
Oh wait, no, here's more here's more stuff for you guys. So you guys are gonna have a chance to win a few packs here. Um I think some of these might actually be extra packs too. Speed duel. You guys are gonna have a chance to win a lot of packs. Let's see what we got. This is what I actually bought. This stuff is thrown out for you guys with the giveaway. First mini package, we have four reprint packs. So we got the blue eyes, metal raiders, spell ruler, and pharaoh servant. So that's pretty cool. Then we have a blue eyes pack, metal raiders, magic ruler, and pharaoh servant. I think he said he got these from 0310 and 0310, so uh, they should be the spell but magic cards. They're, they're called MRL, but they have spell written on them, so that's pretty cool. Finally, we have an original LOB pack, a first edition Metal Raiders pack, first edition Magic Ruler pack, and a first edition Pharaoh Servant. Hey, look, can we can we pull the Jinzo? Can we get that Jinzo luck again? What do you think? Trifecta of first eds. So 12 booster packs with... The originals, the LOB is not first edition, that would be insane. Then we have 2003 packs and we have reprint packs. So that's going to be a crazy opening. That's going to be tomorrow. So make sure you guys check in for that one. That's going to be a really awesome video. 12 pack opening with originals, 2003s. Okay, I just mixed them all up, but it's going to be really good. I'm really excited to do it. All right, and the final package, this one has something pretty big in it. Oh, we have a box, okay? This is from one of you guys. This is just sent in by one of you guys. The last one I purchased, this one I did not. This one was sent by one of you guys. I think it has a note in here. All right, we have a note at the top. Let's see what it says before we open everything up. Ruxin, inside this box is a mix of Pokemon and Yu-Gi-Oh cards. You can do what you want with them. I think you'll like this mix, okay? It's what I had left in my collection besides two PSA graded cards. Hope you enjoy. Could you please send me a signed Pecanio Moth uh, back to me? Include as envelope pre-filled. I love that, that's great. If you pre-fill the envelope, it really helps. Sorry for the Paw Patrol box. It was what I had. No, that's great, Mike. That's Thank you, Mike, for sending that stuff in. I'll definitely send you that Pequeno Moth. All right, first thing we have. Thanks for the awesome content, Rux. So, did he sign his own card? That's cool. So he sent us a signed card. That's pretty I like that signature. It looks good. The Lycan Rock. Oh, what is this? What is this? Okay, time out. I can't read it. It's an Umbreon. There's something written on it. Oh, there it is. It's on the back. That's why. It goes through. This is my favorite Pokemon. I didn't know what this card was, so I figured I'd send it to you. That, me either. I don't know what this is. But look at... Oh, my goodness. That's why we could see the, the writing. It's see-through. Does, it, does anybody know what this is? I guess we can find out for Mike. I'm sure one of you guys knows what this is. It's like... It feels weird. Like, it's like flimsy, but also kind of solid. It's weird. That's really cool. That actually looks really awesome. Umbreon is a super cool Pokemon. All right, next thing we got, we have... Oh, this isn't... Oh, the Bujinte Susanoo. <laughs> How do we open this thing? Um, oh, I see. I see. Bujinte Susanoo. Jurassic Impact. So this looks like he opened a Legendary Duelist Season 1. Got all these cool cards. Oh, there we go. The IOC Strike Ninja. Oh, the Halo. And the Ancient Gear Fusion. That's pretty cool. So he definitely opened a Legend or Duelist Season 1 on that one. Then we have some Pokemon cards. Gotta catch them. Okay, this is from uh, Delta Species. So that's like a 2003 area. I think it's around there. Somewhere around. So we got a lot of Pokemon. We got some Pikachus, another Zangoose. Charmander. Bad. These are the ones that are like electric type. He's a Charmander, but he's electric. So it's like Delta Species means they're like different. Wait, whoa. Okay, that's just a wrapper. Okay. These are like super rare. These these pop. Oh, are these from Pop Series? Maybe that's what it is. Pop Series Five. Okay, that makes sense. So these are from Pop Series Five, the one with the gold the gold star uh, Umbreon and Espeon that are like they're non hollow, but they're extremely expensive. So it looks like he opened some of those packs. That's really cool. Okay, so maybe that's what this is. Maybe it's just like stuff he's opened, you know, and he pulled some cool stuff. So for those he didn't get, I, I'm guessing he didn't get the uh, the ones. Maybe they're the two PSA Grady cards that he still has. This is from what is this? DRL Dragons of Legend 2. So does he have a... Uh, oh, there's a uh, Chaos Rider Gustav. That's cool. So it looks like he opened some IOC as well. Red Eyes Spirit. That's like... very. That reminds me of the... Uh, no, that's the Red Eyes Black Dragon. That reminds me of Duel Links. But so does a lot of things, as you guys know. So that's cool. Red Eyes Toon Dragon. That's nice. Yeah, the red when they added the black to Red Eyes Black Dragon, that was pretty weird. Because it's like it's been Red Eyes for so long. He's got some Japanese, old, some Japanese cards in here. Pokemon. Alright, let's see what this is. This is... Oh, wow. E-Reader. E That's pretty pretty cool. Cyndaquil. Dratini. 
from Rocket, like that. What is this from? I don't know what that Articuno is from. Torchic. That seems like a little bit newer, so I'm not totally sure what it's from. Togedemaru, Clefable, Dratini, Dratini, Spoink, Crocetta, Pikachu, Fungus. Such a weird Pokemon. Just look at that. It looks like, I don't know, that just looks strange. Litten. Oh, we got some uh, base set cards. That's cool. Let's see what they are. Squir Squirtle, Charmander, and we got two Pikachus. So they're both yellow cheek ones. I'm trying to remember when you can get, can you get red cheek unlimited? I don't know if you can. I don't think you can. I can't remember. It's a lot of, a lot of work to remember all these, uh, this TCG info, guys. A lot of work. <laughs> all right, next thing. We've got a Summer Summer Summoner. <laughs> That's such a funny card. We got some LOB rares. Trap of the Infernal Tomb. Pot of Greed. That's a nice card. Curse of Darkness. Raging Mad Plants and Rage Battle Locks. Ooh, Demok. That's awesome. Harpy Queen. And Aquanor. That's a lot of LOB rares. You open a few LOB packs. Oh, wow. We've got two more things. Okay, these have top loaders. So, top loaders. I'm getting a little, getting a little excited here. What could be in the top loaders? Here we go. Oh, they flipped around. Oh, wow. That's nice. I actually pulled the full art of this. I don't open much Pokemon, but I've actually pulled a full art of that. Snorlax Rare from Jungle. That's amazing. Oh, and there's a... Uh, is that the card? Yeah, there's a Shining... What is this called? Alolan Vulpix. That's what it's called. Shiny Alolan Vulpix. That's a lot of extra things to, to a Vulpix. Shiny and Alolan. So that's pretty cool. Then we have... Wow, Eevee and Snorlax GX. Full art. That's really cool. So we got a couple uh, full arts. And the final mini pack here. Also in top loaders. So let's see. Oh. Pikachu and Mimikyu. He's like, what's going on? You are definitely just a copy of me. <laughs> Check that out. That's pretty funny. All right, flip these around. A uh, uh, Mimikyu. All right. Litten. Watch it have like the Pikachu full art in here. I'm just kidding. It's like $300 card. Deancey. Togedemaru. Mewtwo. That, that's cool. That's a promo. That's a cool promo. Oh, look at that. Rayquaza. That's a promo, but that looks old. How old is this? That kind of looks old for some reason. Rayquaza, that looks really good. Check that card out. Is that in, like, snow? That looks good. That card looks nice. Some of you Pokemon experts are going to have to let me know. What card is this, and where's it from? Wow, so, Mike, that was an awesome little package you sent. So, I appreciate you sending all that stuff. That was a lot of fun. Thank you again to you guys who send me mail. If you guys want to send it, check out that P.O. box down below. Also, if you want to become a member, get the, the special benefits of that kind of stuff, then click the join button down below. And that's it for this video. See you guys later. Peace. Oh! Yes. Oh. Elemental Hero, Dark Bright. Boom! Oh! <laughs> <laughs>